that's, that's I heard Alex Jones talking about human animal hybrids uh, earlier. Like maybe this is what he was talking. You, you about. laugh all you want about that. Oh, uh, you want <laughs> I, Woody's face makes me want to find the clip of Alex Jones talking about the hybrids. It's it's pretty outrageous. He mentioned insect human hybrids, uh, jellyfish human hybrids. Uh, let's see, Alex Jones human hybrids. That man hybrids. is a goddamn maniac. He's a goddamn maniac. Yeah, here it's only a minute and twenty two seconds long. I have a I have a clip on it. Oh, let me see. Let's cue it zero. This is he is fired up. <laughs> this is this is look Oh, at, this is his classic clip. He is fired up. Oh, maybe this is the wrong I am a human. <laughs> yeah, that's that that's this one. Are you sure it's the right one? I I'm this not sure. Good. I mean, it, it's good no matter what, but but I, I should look deeper for the high. God, he's angry in this. He's angry in all of his clips. <laughs> I'm ready when you're ready. Let me make... I, there may be a better clip. Okay. Yeah, yeah, here... This is better. This is better. This is him actually talking about the science of the human hybrids. Science of the human hybrids. How long is this? It's three minutes, but we don't need to watch it all. You know, we'll we we could probably get a minute or so in and get the gist. See how it okay. goes. All right. Yeah, the way we do this, Arian, is you just open it up and then Woody will count us down and we can all play. Got you. Okay, cool. Are you cute at zero? Let's do it. On play. Yep. Three, two, one, play. Thousands of companies are creating transgenetic cross species hybrids, splicing plants, animals, and insects and releasing the new <laughs> organisms into the global biosphere, vandalizing the very genetic code of the planet. Human-animal chimeras are gestating on U.S. research farms. And then I knew what the next line would be. They're growing human tissue in cows and pigs, just like they call babies tissue or embryonic stem cells when they're seven months old being butchered live on a table and dissected. They take them out live and then hook them up to apparatus to keep them alive and then, and then harvest them. Told you that 20 years ago. Now it's mainstream news. I've told you this thousands of times, and I've seen this article, let's not exaggerate, 100 plus times. Similar, it's always the same playbook. Oh, did you know some firms are starting to implant tissue inside cows, inside pigs? Ladies and gentlemen, they're not implanting tissue. They're growing humanoids up to 50 and 60 pounds inside cows and inside pigs. And I'm going to say something else right now. That's what we know was going on Making good points. 30 years ago. <laughs> because when I learned about it 20 years ago, it was in research papers declassified 10 years before that and they were creating humanoids for organ harvesting inside humanoids. cows and pigs publicly publicly and and, and basically the they're, and shit. they're humans without <laughs> heads because that even freaks the researchers out too much so they can kind of grow them like they want and you can argue well it's just what? a person i want those organs but they've had to make the humans the humanoids part cow part sheep part pig to implant them. So, again, MIT, here it is. We're not making it up. There are, in fact, spider goats. And so these, right, kids have the genes for a spider in them. Yes. This is, it's insane. Goats. And where does the spider silk actually get silk from the milk. come from? I mean, where where well, do you get it? Well, it was a silk sort of in the milk. They, they, they look like such normal goats, but in fact, they're totally unique and, and, and bizarre. I mean, this is bizarre. The goat just lurched out and bit him. I would not see it. <laughs> <laughs> a silk that can and be used for body armor, danger. as well as other yeah. things. And if that wasn't enough, how about a glow that's, in the that's dark? Probably yeah. right, that's probably enough. I think, I think, that, that's, I think it's this gentleman, I, I think this is his channel, which is great. I, I'm subscribing <laughs> right now. <laughs> oh, get the fuck out of here. Alex Jones is so convincing and authoritative. I'm there wondering, what mic is that? How can right. I get that? If I just bob my head a lot and talk with some bass, will people buy any bullshit I spew? Maybe. Yeah. A we knew about this 30 years ago. We told you about it 20 years ago. <laughs> and I made my own 
pig hybrid ten years ago. <laughs> Back when the intelligence was declassified, Me. I'm Wilbur. a pig. Kyle, Wilbur. Kyle, Wilbur. 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 Looking to tell do. the people, tell the people, Wilbur, how you were spawned. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm Alex Jones, pig baby. <laughs> well, Kyle, you're, you're missing out on the main point. What they're going to do is they're going to take the brains of those who oppose the government and put those brains into pigs. You will be a fully sentient person in a pig body, totally incapable of doing it. They will feed you to the rest of the government. You will bring home the bacon and cook it in the pan. All right, we'll be right back after this. We're going to talk about some protein powder, some bone broth, and uh, my my neck thickening agent. (laughs) It's a salve. (laughs) The neck thickening salve. (laughs) Rub it on Uh, twice a day. I'm surprised he doesn't sell like tinfoil hats or like like something like serious, because he's already Tinful got these. He sells the buckets fun. of survival oh, food. I bet he sells so much, uh, so much volume of those water filters, where because oh, yeah. he's because that's one of his main things, right? Is fluoride is gonna poison you. It's Make not you something gay. that um, pretty much every dentist on the planet is like, yeah, pretty good for your teeth. How do you how do you know that it's good for your teeth? Well, <laughs> I went to dental school, and we look at different municipalities with different. One has fluoride, one doesn't, and we see a higher rate of rotting here. No, that's not true. That's because, and then he just goes on to say something else ridiculous, and then it ends in the Clintons being behind it. (laughs) (laughs) Hillary is a fluoride addict. (laughs) It powers her. (laughs) 